Thank you, Gretchen. Next position is the County Commission Super District 4, John Gage, Republican. John? Thank you, Mom. Good evening. I want to welcome each and every one of you personally, and I want to say it's a great opportunity to stand before you, and thank you for giving me the opportunity to run. Uh, I've been in Lowndes County for nine years. I started number, number one, first day. I wanted to find out how could I help my community. I found out there was no uh, Toy for Tots program, which is dear to my heart. I've been doing that for 19 years. So I started a Toy for Tots program nine years ago. And since then, I've helped over 400,000 children in nine counties. I believe that our children uh, should be serviced. Also, I served uh, in the military, the United States Army. I'm very proud of it. I've been, I spent three tours in Vietnam. Came home, a little, a little messed up. Had, had a couple band-aids, but uh, we made it. And uh, some of the issues that I want to look at is number one: why don't we have a public transportation? I keep hearing it's too costly. I think we need to work harder. If we want businesses to come into our community and stay in our community, I think we need a public transportation on a couple of reasons. Number one, a lot of our people that uh, cannot afford transportation, uh, such as a car or whatever, can't get work. They can't get work. They're on the welfare rolls. And they don't feel good about themselves either. I found that out. They really don't want to be there. That's a bad place. They want to be proud of themselves. They want to give back to the community as well. So we uh, provide transportation that's going to help the uh, people out of work get to work. Also, the elderly. Some of our elderly, they can't drive anymore. They're depending on other people. Sometimes I talked to one lady, she said it took her nine days to get somebody home to take her to the grocery store. I said, well, what, what have you been eating? She said, a little bit here, a little bit there. And uh, that's sad, you know, it really is sad. I think we as uh, a group of people, we need to be more neighborly. I know when I was a kid, we knew everybody in our neighborhood. Today they don't. We just don't get out. So we need to do that. We need to make this our community. We've got to help each other. So uh, with that, transportation will be able to help us. Uh, because some of our church friends, they live a distance. And if they, the elderly can't get to you, or you can't get to them, then maybe we need to do that. The other thing is, of course, the infrastructure. Roads, we need better roads. Also, we need a full-time fire department in the county. I don't know if you know this or not, but we do not have a full-time fire department. We need it, and people want it, and we've got to look at how we're going to get it. Uh, the other thing is uh, the wages for the, for the sheriff's department. Uh, they're less than what the city police department is, and it's unfair to our, our law enforcement to make less. And I want to thank you tonight. Thank you for the opportunity. And I just want to be your voice, your vote. And if there's any issues, please let me know. Thank you.